everyone and welcome back to another tack haul. So this tack haul is the long awaited Mary's tent sale tack haul and yeah, I got some stuff. <laughs> oh my god. I got some things. We're going to try to make it not as long as last year. I didn't buy as much stuff as last year because I didn't just get two new horses like I did last year. So this, there's a mountain stuff on the ground here that I just wish you could see but not because I need to vacuum my carpet. Anyhow, I'm, I'm just going to jump into it and try not to spend like too much time on everything because there is so much that I need to get through. So these are the things that I bought today. Today's Friday. I was there right in the morning when they opened and the whole experience there will be a separate like tent sale vlog. And I'm also going back in a couple days on Sunday where everything well, not everything, but some things are marked up in discount. So things that were normally 15% off will be like 20% off. That's what I'm going to be like marked up. Not like it would be $50 one day and like $70 next. Not that kind of markup. The percentage discount was marked up. So I'm going to go back and see if I can find some more things. Um, yeah, so that whole little like Sunday haul will be added at the end of this video to be like one giant haul so I'm just gonna jump into it I'm gonna start with the things that my mom and Jamie got all right these are the German horse muffins and it's so metallic you can't really see it maybe I don't know anyhow it's a I almost dropped it six pound bag of horse cookies they look like that and these were horse treats were 20% off so Jamie bought that with his own money and then my mom my mom bought this stuff with her money but it's for um, most of the stuff is for Prince but one thing is for Ami well all of them really so I'll show you what she got so we got a month's supply of quiescence so Prince is going to be really hyper when he comes back into work and I wanted some type of calming supplement for him just for like that first month just to take the edge off. So um, horse supplements were 20% off and Adeptus products were 25% off and I'll get to that later. But we just got a month's supply of Quiescence horse calming supplement for Prince. And then, oh there's, oh double bagged, got it, they, they come in like these big bags. Instead of regular shopping, there we go, shopping bags. And then we also got a month's supply of Hyla Lube by Select the Best Supplements. It's kind of like a knockoff of Lubricin joint supplement. So it's a month's worth. And again, it is for prints. And this was also 20% off and there was a $4 off coupon. So this ended up being like less than $20. Just not bad. Um, okay. She got a banana licket for Prince and Misty. Just banana, I'm sure you guys know what they are. And a new pair of the, what are they? I got these last year. The KL Italian Bell Boots Black Size Large. Yeah, are these the right size? I hope they're the right size. Yeah, I think these are the right size. Um, size four and they just say made in Italy. They're just regular black pull on bell boots. They're the kind that actually last and stay on and they can take, you know, some knocks and everything. Um, his last pair that I got at the last tent sale, they went on him that day I bought them and they are still on him to the stakes. He has to live in bell boots and they're just now starting to like crack right here just from age. So I figured it was time to get a new pair and yeah, they are a little bit pricier, like 36, but then like 15% off of that. But they last the whole year. I'm not having to buy a pair of $12 bell boots every other month. So it ends up being worth it. Here I am rambling on again. And then my mom got... Okay, so I really like to use the Ice Vibe boots on Ami after I do a lot of dressage work or I'm jumping or like cross country, that kind of thing. So what I did, what I do is I have... Sorry, my hair is like really annoying me. I have the Ice Vibe knee boots that go on Ami, I have the tendon boots in the size full that go on him, and then a while ago I bought a set of the tendon boots used to use on the back legs even though they're a tad bit small, but after a few months the vibration panels on it broke 
and it would be like $70 just to replace the vibration panels and they weren't the right size anyhow of boot so I never bothered so I ended up buying well you'll see like I I bought a pair of the extra full ice vibes and then to complete the set since Ami is older and still competing and for the young ones too for in the future what is my hair doing I don't know um, she bought the ice vibe hawk boots so they just come with the bag. They come with the ice packs, the charger, the vibration panels, and the outer like boots, I guess. And this is what they look like. They just go on the hawk, these ones. And these were, I believe, 15% off. All right, so I think that's all my mom bought. Yes, I bought the rest of everything that's here. So just really quick, um, when you make a purchase, you get a free bucket and there's like a couple samples so I made a purchase my mom did and Jamie did so we got three buckets my iPhone is being propped on one bucket because I forgot my tripod at the barn but just really quick oh this is like the sheet of what all is discounted at how much um so each bucket had a sample of the I don't know how to pronounce it Equus Equus barn barrier natural fly repellent um, so I got three of these. My dog is scratching to come in here. Hold on. Come on. Oh, that's not even you, Benny. Get out. Get out, Quentin. Fine. Wasn't even my dog. It was my brother's dog right here. Oh, someone got the bark collar. <laughs> someone put the bark collar on you. He's right here. He is a... Dachshund. Hi Colton. That's lovely. Um, anyhow, each bucket came with a bucket, a sample of the beet treats, which I've never tried before, and that fly spray that I showed you. So I have three of these, three of these, and three of these turquoise buckets. It's turquoise. I don't know if it's really coming across. It's turquoise. Um, Alright, next. This stuff's kind of heavy. Um, undo the knot. How do I undo you? There we go. What are you doing, Colt? He wants to be in the video. I babysit my brother's dog all the time for extended periods. <laughs> he lives here practically half the time. The dog, not my brother. <laughs> all right. has my name on it. Alright, so then I got a jar of the Sornamore poultice. I love this stuff. It's the only poultice I use. Needed a new jar. And I also got Magic Cushion, the Extreme formula, like the Mega formula. Extreme. Yeah, they call it Extreme. And it's the two-pound tub. And this had a $2 off coupon and was 20% off. And this was also 20% off the poultice. I'll try to give you the percentages as I go so you can get an idea of what I paid. And then since the PS bridles have the wider crown piece, it's hard to set it on the hooks I have that I keep all my bridles and stuff on. So I just got these little, you know, generic bridle hangers. Um, I just got four of these. And there's another one somewhere. And these were 20% off. I'm going to stick those back in there. Alright, um, right, this next thing's pretty cool. Um, I've been wanting it for a while, I just never really did, because it's not like super cheap, but it's also not like really expensive. <sighs> oh, it's sliding down. Okay, and it's a blanket bag, I believe it's called, store front, stall front storage bag, stall front bag with pockets. Alright, so I will show you what it looks like. Well, I mean, there's a picture, but it doesn't do it justice. So this is a bag you put on a stall front, and it holds blankets, wraps, boots, fly sprays, anything you want, really. And it has a carry strap right here with clips, and then it also has these little things that you can hang with, like, a four-hook hanger along the stall. And so, let's assuming I'm hanging it right here. Here's the little lid, and then it has these clips right here. It is really big. I probably can't show it in the frame. Yeah, 
So it has mesh on the sides, it has a steel bottom so it hopefully won't bend. Um, yeah, and then it's blue, like waterproof nylon on the outside. So anyhow, it opens up like this. And then on the inside, right here, there's pockets so you can put fly spray and brushes and stuff in. And then you have, this is really hard to show. Then you have like a really deep pocket you can put like blankets and stuff and it's really nice for horse shows and it has a little grippy holder for your shoulder and you can unclip these um yeah i thought this would be really good to take to shows so when i'm at shows and the horses are in temporary stalls it's kind of a hassle finding a place to put all your wraps and blankets and whatever you want because uh, i mean you could put it in your trunk but then when you're riding and trying to groom your horse and get them ready it's hard to be like digging through saddle pads and blankets and stuff to try to get to your grooming stuff in my experience um, but if you leave your blankets out, it just looks a little bit more messy and like Mia and Prince, they like to like nibble on stuff. So I'd rather them nibble on this rather than blankets and wraps and stuff. So this will come in handy now that I'm going to be taking Mia to some schooling shows this year. And this top piece has a metal frame to keep the box shape and it folds down really well. So once it's empty, it folds like, can I even do it again? There we go. Folds down to just this. So it would fit in a tack trunk very easily. What are you doing, Colt? What are you doing? All right. Next thing I got is sand rid. Um, I like to do this every few months. I know it's suggested you do it every month, like a sand purge, but they don't really eat on the sand that often, if at all. Um, so just every once in a while to be safe, I like to do this. So I got the sand red purge for the horses. And this was 20% off. Colt, you're in my lap, buddy. What are you doing? And then I got Ami's favorite horse treats as like a late happy birthday present thing. Uh, it's a uh, five pound bag of the Mrs. Pastures horse treats. These are legit his favorite horse treats ever. And that's the actual treat. So 20% off. Got him a bag. Colts, buddy. Alright. The next thing is kind of heavy. So, oh my god. I'll try to show it. But it's the Nimble Mega Nutrient Supplement by Adeptus. And it's uh, 20 pounds. Yeah, this bucket is 20 pounds. And it's a six month. Oh my god, it's heavy. Hold on. It's awkward trying to hold it this way. Whew. Nimble. Mega nutrient. So it's like a 7-in-1, all-in-one type of supplement. So joint, hoof, coat. Uh, yeah. <laughs> hold on, let me read the label. Uh, comprehensive 7-in-1 formula for horses. Joint, tendon, ligament, vitamin, mineral, hoof, antioxidants, coat, prebiotic. Whew, has a mouthful. So it's a six month supply and um, just to hold me over till Mary sale next year because this was 25% off which is kind of unheard of for like joint supplements and stuff especially for a good brand like Adeptus. I got two of these so I have a year supply. But yeah, so two of those. It's really heavy. Ow. There's like tape on it. It's got my hair stuck. Alright, two of those. And then now onto the fun stuff. This is too heavy to bring up here. I keep having to undo the little knots in the bags. Colt, you want it in. You better not scratch to get back out. He wants out of my room now. Why is this so hard? Ugh. So this is fun stuff. Um, some of these were needs, some of these were wants. So what I do is I prioritize everything. I make a list of everything I need, like supplements, um, basics, but a lot of the basics I bought at Adam's Pet Supply, Horse Supply. Now he's scratching on my door to go out. Hold on. Here, Colt. Go. Go. <sighs> so, a lot of the um, needs I actually ended up buying at Adam's, but if they didn't have it at Adam's, I bought them at Mary's. Like the Poultice and the Sworn or more. Or the same thing. And the Magic Cushion, they had it Adams, but I would have paid a lot of money in shipping for it. So, because it wasn't included in free shipping. So I ended up just getting it at Mary's instead. So now we're moving on to like 
yeah, fun stuff. So, bell boots. These are the new professional choice Spartan bell boots with the fluffy tops. I already have these actually. I got them a few weeks ago, like literally the day or two, or the day or the day after they came out with them. And my dog's barking. That's a struggle. Anyhow, I have the black ones with the natural fleece top in the size large, which is what Mia normally wears, but they didn't have XL at the time and I need something with the fleece top. So I went ahead and used them anyhow and they fit on me well, the size, so that's why I didn't take them back. But I did end up getting a size up in white because they were out of the black today. So the, I don't know if you can tell, they're the professional choice, has like a hard coating, nice fluffy tops. And then it has the double velcro in the front and little uh, no turn knob right there. And it comes with a little like plasticky bracelet thingy. But yeah, so um, I'm hoping these will fit her and be a little bit taller this way for her. So those were needs since she needs fluffy bell boots. Um, okay, what next? What is this? Okay, shirts. I got four shirts. How many riding shirts do I have? I have too many. I mean, I wear riding clothes every single day. I ride my horses. My job is riding horses and taking care of them. So you need riding clothes. <laughs> That's my justification. And wearing the same old stuff gets boring anyhow. But anyhow, these riding shirts were on clearance. So these were on clearance for 50 each, normally 75. So that is, I don't know what the discount is on that. Uh, yeah, you can do the math on that. Anyhow, this is the Castell Charlotte Sun shirt. I love these. I have a ton of these. Uh, this is the gray color with the orange underarm and orange inside collar. Has the embroidery on the arm with the Castell and the little logo on the back. I wear a size medium in these sun shirts. The one I'm wearing right now is the Dover brand. Um, not like the regular Dover Cool Blast, but one of their, um, like the little like nicer collections or whatever melange I don't remember I have a Dover vlog haul if you want to see that but um this one is actually a small which is really surprising but this one is light package magic a keep oh I got a package from magic a keep sorry I just had like a text come across my video from my grandpa saying I had a package from magic a keep and speaking of magic a keep I have a very exciting video coming up soon for Magic a Heap, so stay tuned for that. Anyhow, uh, yes, so Castell, I wear a size medium in these. So I got this shirt, and then I got another one, and they had like 10 different colors of these for the sale price. And they had even more that were 25% off, because all sun shirts were 25% off. This is a really pretty turquoise color. They call it teal slash white. And again, it's in medium has the same logo there. It has white on the inside of the collar and white on the inside of the arm. And it has the regular little logo on the back or the flag, I should say. Medium. All right, more stuff, yay. Um, lead rope, I always like to get a lead rope because they break, they get old, the clips stop working. So I got a lead rope. This one is by Shockamo Sports. Right there, these were 15% off, it has I don't know if you know this about Shockamole, but they have the nickel clips, so if your hardware on your halter has nickel clips, there you go. Um, nylon, braided, this one's black, gray, and white. And then up here, it's like a little um, rubbery tag, and it has Shockamole, and then on the back, it has a place to put your name on it and pen, so you always know if it's yours. Um, I don't always use this, so I just cut mine off personally, but that's really cool if you're at a boarding bar and you want to keep track of your stuff. Next is, what is this? A neck strap, okay. So, um, right before I went to Shepherd Ranch, I wanted to get a neck strap for Mia and her neck is too thick for a regular belt to work or a stirrup leather. So I ended up getting these jump straps from None Finer. Uh, None Finer. Yeah, so it's actually called a neck grab strap leather and this is the color Havana. The one I got back in August for Shepherd was black. All they had was black with a little brass buckle. I think it's brass buckle, maybe not. But um, I only use it when I jump and all my jump tack is brown. So, I mean, having a black one is better than nothing. It was only $20, so that's not bad. So I'm going to sell that one and I got a brown one to match my tack. 
so $20 and then there's 15% off on top of that. New jump strap because I ride Mia and Prince with that. Yes, I don't want to die. <laughs> what is next? Okay. Reins. So I loved those PS of Sweden reins so much that I got for Mia. I got them in black for my dressage bridal. Mia's PS dressage bridal. So they are the Softy Reins Super Grip. Black, size full. PS of Sweden. Yes. I'm obsessed with the PS. They're just a uh, nice, I don't think they're calfskin, I don't know. It feels like it could be calfskin, but it's a little bit more sturdy than that. With the Sure Grip rubber insides, rubber calfskin. Dog is scratching on my door again. Mm. Has hand stops, and then it's leather at the bottom. Is that Benny or Colt? Then it has the little rain stops. Um, because these are going to be dressage ring for me, I'm going to cut these off. And then it has buckle ends and you have the option of the elastic cradle. Hold on for the third time. Colton, seriously? I got Colt again. Can't make up his mind, apparently. And he's in my lap. Alright, and the other PS of Sweden thing I got... This is the rolled throat latch black size cob, which is also number two. Uh, Mia wears full size bridle, but cob size throat latch. And I don't really know why, but I opted for the rolled leather throat latch because I think it'd be a little bit more delicate on her face since she does have such a narrow, fine boned thoroughbred face. And the rolled ones come pre punched, size two. No, it just has a C for cob for cob. But yeah, so that's the throat latch, and if you watch my PS video, you will know how this throat latch goes on the bridle. Alright, next thing. Alright, these are heavy. Okay, these are the Ice Five boots I was telling you about. Colt, stop. These are the extra full size. They say extra full right there. These are the regular tenon boots. And I don't know, I think this is what they look like. It kind of looks like a SMB boot and there's pockets inside for the full length vibrating panel and then you have the ice boot you put on first and then put the outer boot on top of it and it comes with the charging box and the adapter cables and this is the actual vibrating panel Let's see and then you press and hold it I wonder if it's charged yeah can you hear it yeah okay cool um, so this goes back in here. Colt, you just have to be in the middle of everything. It's a town hall, not a dog hall. Alright, and then... More shirts. Yeah, more shirts. Um, I love the Asmar shirts. The long sleeve tee, to be more specific. I have these in several colors, and I've been eyeing this color for a long time. I was just waiting for it to go on sale. It's the color Forest, and it's in the size large. I wear large in Asmar, but it's this really nice, like, hunter-y, foresty green. It has the Asmar logo there, and then Asmar Equestrian down the sleeve. Love these to pieces. And I got a second one. This one's just black. It's the same style. Noel Asmar. Asmar down the sleeve. Uh, Asmar on the front. Asmar. There we go. Um, okay. Polo wraps. I got a pair of the Back on Track Polo wraps. These were, oh, these sun shirts were 25% off. But I didn't already say that. The PS Reigns were 15% off and the Throat Latch was 15% off. And the Ice Vibes were 15% off. Back on track, these, I don't remember if these are 15 or 20% off, I don't remember, but they are the back on track polo wraps and they have the ceramic lining on the inside and these are really nice for the days that Ami has stocked up hind legs or if it's cold I can put them on and ride and that'll be nice. Not going to zip them up, there we go. Um, okay, we got more samples of stuff. Uh, here's another one. 
All right, so there's different vendors for different companies there, and they pass out samples. So I ended up getting a Veterisin wound care spray sample. See, it says like vendor sample, which is really cool because you can buy a bottle not much bigger than this for $20, which seems like a lot, but I mean, a little does go a long way. But seriously, this will last me like a year, which is not bad for a free sample. And Equery, I believe is how you say it. This is the brand. It's a supplement brand with really nice products that actually work. So I got a sample for the Large Animal Probiotic. So, yeah, that's one sample worth. And then the Equaries Plus, which is a complete probiotic equine supplement. So it's like your vitamins, minerals, probiotics, prebiotics, that kind of thing. And Equaries Choice, which is complete probiotic equine supplement. I honestly don't know what the difference is between these two. Mm. I don't know. Apparently they're slightly different. Or one is pellet and one is that. Don't know. We'll find out though. Alright, the next thing I got is a cooler. This is the Leather Vita Wick Dry Cooler Standard Neck. It looks like that. And so it's actually really cool. I've seen a ton of people with these and I've always wanted one. And because sometimes a cooler is like a fleece cooler is too thick but then a scrim is too thin especially for baths and stuff but the mesh itself is navy and then it has gray and white trim which are my colors anyhow and the inside is this really soft like fleecy moisture wicking material and then the bottom part is the mesh and it has the adjustable buckle at the chest and a hidden surcingle and a tail strap and this is in the size 81, and this was 25% off. Or 20%. One year 25. I don't remember, I don't have to look at the receipt. And then I think there's just one more thing. Yeah. Oh, no, more things, but okay. So I need a new girth for Prince, and his girth groove is set like further up than where the saddle sits. So I've always had to find an anatomical girth and the one I had wasn't quite working for him and it's just something I've been thinking about for a long time and then I saw a fellow YouTuber talk about it and then I was like, okay, so I'm not the only one who had that idea and feeling about it. So she just like gave me the push really to just go ahead and resell the girth. So I've sold one and oh, I had two in different sizes so I sold one and I'm still working on selling another. I think I found a person to buy it. But I've been looking for a new girth to replace that for Prince when he finally comes back into work. So I saw this one and I thought it might be a good match for him. It's the uh, Micmar Comfort Dressage Girth Black in the size 24. So this is a dressage girth unlike anything I've seen before. So the inside, this piece right here and this piece is leather. And then this piece is like, I don't even know what material it is. It's not, I don't think it's neoprene. Okay. It's a non-slip rubber. It's not neoprene. Uh, it, it's kind of like layered and it has this pattern that goes on their, like the very underside like that. And it's supposed to be anatomical for the way their bodies are built with the whole like, yeah. So it's a wide set piece and then you have material here. And here and it's not fully attached like you can see that on both sides because this outer material here is really breathable but it's also like stretchy and then it has a d-ring if you need to attach anything it has the logo for the girth and then the little straps velcro and then you have the buckles so I'm really tempted to try this not tempted since I bought it of course but I'm curious to see how this is going to fit him because it is so like adjustable and stretchy. I'm curious to see if it's adjustable enough to fit him better since he is a little bit of a hard fit. And if it doesn't work, then I'm returning it Sunday. So either way, I need to try this on him today because it's going to rain tomorrow and you can't like put this on a muddy horse and then return it. So that I'm going to be trying on today. And then... The two last things I bought I don't have in here with me, but I got a bag of the Cavalora Strugo Mix Senior for Ami, and that's in the back of my truck, and a new like pitchfork, rake, you know, like rake, durafork, 
and that's also in the back of my truck because that's really awkward to bring in the house and handle. Yeah, okay, so now I'm going to show you what I got on Sunday. So keep watching and see what I got on Sunday. Hey guys, um, so here is day two's tack haul. I thought I'd be going Sunday, but I ended up not. It is Saturday and it is like, what, 5.30ish? So it's going to be dark soon, so that's why it's not like very bright. But my mom is being the tripod, so she's she jiggling. All right, this is like super messy right now because I haven't had time to like put stuff away. But I show you what I got today. So obviously, like right off the bat, yes, another PS bridle. Um, PS of Sweden. It's the Jump Off Revolution bridle in the size full. And I got another one. I already have one right here. But um, so this is the one I got at the Mary sale last year for Prince. But then um, I tried it on Mia, and Mia went really well in it. So. Mia pretty much commandeered it from Prince, and since Prince is going to be going back into work soon, and this is what he went really well in, and they wear different bits and everything, and I'm too lazy to switch bits every day and adjust the straps. So I just got another one, and this was 15% off and double points, because so they have like a point value system. So that's just the bridle. And then the Weather Beta um, cooler thing combo cooler that I got yesterday did not fit on me it was the right size it just wasn't the right cut for his body type so I ended up getting the Rambo Grand Prix cooler in the size 81 it looks like that I don't know if the glare is too bad looks like that and this was 20% off and then since the quiescence was such a good deal I ended up getting another month's supply of that for prints I got another thing of sand red because I didn't realize the last one was only enough for two horses. And for Misty and Prince, I got another tub for them. And, okay, and then down here is the rest of the stuff. This something. Alright, I got this hanging hook. So the blanket, like, what's it called? It's like a bag. Like blanket a storage bag, stall front blanket storage bag that thing that I showed you guys um, in the yesterday's tech haul I guess um, I bought this little hook that you hang over the door or a stall and then you can hang the bag on these hooks so you have a way to hang it so I just got that and it was 20% off and then I got another like bag of stuff um, where's the opening they ran out of giveaway buckets today so good thing we went yesterday and got our yeah, free buckets. Mary's buckets. All right, um, one of the samples I got yesterday were of these like little samples of supplements. Equaries Plus. Yeah, so it is the right one I got. Um, he liked it and ate it, so I went ahead and got a month supply. It's the Equary, Equaries Plus, I think I'm saying it right. Probiotics, enzymes, live yeast cultures, vitamins, minerals, selenium, and biotin. It's a 40 day supply and this was 20% off. And Ami liked it and he's a picky eater, so that's good. Has all the ingredients. So I got that to take the place of his um, probios, probios, however you say it. All the same to me. Uh, another grooming block. This was 20% off and it had a 50 cent off coupon. Um, I got a ton more of the Equary samples to try out the different types they have. So more of those, these were free of course. I got the correct size throat latch since the one I got yesterday, the throat, the roll throat latch was a little bit too tight on the loosest hook. So I got a different one and they didn't have the bigger size and the rolled leather, so I had to get the plain flat leather. Here's that. And I rode Ami with the back on track polo wraps yesterday and they worked so well that I bought another pair of them in black just so I have a full set of four. I know in my wrapping video I said I never ride in polo wraps because they just don't really do much in elastic wraps. If I'm going to wrap, the elastic wraps do more in my opinion, but these are different. These have the ceramic fibers and they are therapeutic wraps. So I used them and I really liked them, so I bought a second pair to use like all fours if I need, or to use one set while I'm washing the other. And these were 15% off. Back on track, polo wraps. 
And then the last thing I got are these Veritas ankle boots. So they're really cool. I'll show you this one. Whoa, whoa. Was that, was that a, a theft device thing I saw in there? Really? I bought some. I they told left you, the theft design. The I told on. you to look at these things because I'm not trusting their yeah, thing. Yeah, they charged me twice for the bridle. So I'm like, um, that's like way more than I was expecting. So I asked to see the list on the screen. That it was what, like way more. I'm like, um, yeah, you double charged me for the bridle. Um, yeah, so they forgot to take the device off. That happens about once every year, I'd say. Mm -hmm. um, but anyhow. We should have looked before we left. I know. That's a long Darn drive it. to take that little guy off. I know. Maybe uh, I can. We did I don't it know. ourselves last time. I don't know. I just wouldn't want to ruin those. I think those. we, um, I don't know. We'll see. Maybe I'll watch a YouTube video to see if there's an easy way to do it all. I promise I paid for them. I definitely paid for them. But anyhow, they're the Veritas boots, and they're called the uh, TRC Vento Rear, color black, size large. So they're just ankle boots, and what's really cool about them is you have the ventilation right here, you have the elastic strap, double Velcro, the logo, and I don't know what material this is, just hard plastic. It's pretty tough. It tells you what leg it goes on, and then this is like air mesh, and the inside, I don't, it's not neoprene, I don't think. Can bring it out here in better light. Better light. Yeah, I don't know if you can tell, but the foam padding, whatever it is, it's perforated. There's little holes. Is it showing up? Um, maybe? Yeah, now it is. Now it is. Now people can, wait, turn it over. Now people can see all this little perforation. So they're super ventilated for our very hot climate. Okay, and they're real lightweight. And yeah, they're super really light. tough and strong. Yeah, so I mean, they're built good. really good. Can't wait to try these. And they're actually pretty cheap as far as Veritas goes. And they were 15% off. And again, they're the TRC Vento ankle boots by Veritas. Okay. And they're my colors. So that is everything that I got today. Oh, no, I did buy a couple things for the giveaway, but I'm not gonna like spoil surprise in this video. I'll be showing you what things I got for you guys and how to enter in a separate video, not long after this video goes up, so. I got it. I'm still doing it. Thank you guys for watching. Not trying to brag in any way. And this is just the stuff I save up to get every year. And sometimes I get fun stuff like this. Sometimes I get stuff that I need like that. And supplements. And I buy bulk supplements. That's just how I roll. So thanks for watching. Bye. Hey.